Hey guys, um, I appreciate this isn't my normal sort of video, but it's a bit of a one-off. I thought I'd just show you. Um, this is a baby field mouse. He hasn't even opened his eyes yet. He's about, I think he's about five days old. Um, my brother found him yesterday whilst we were walking the dog. Found him in a puddle all by himself. So that's really odd because he should be tucked away in a nest to his mum. Um, so we took him home and I'm taking care of him now, trying to keep him alive and um, make sure he makes it into adulthood or whatever. So um, he's really soft here, really small as you can see in my hand. Hasn't even opened his eyes. And I'm just going to show you what I'm doing to look after him. So if I just put him down a second in there, he'll be fine. Um, I have him in this goldfish bowl for now just to please my mum because the last time I had an animal in the house has escaped so she likes to be able to see it at all times. Um, so that's that. He's basically got cotton wool underneath then a, a paper towel to soak up any wee or whatever he does. Um, and just a flannel to wrap these two water balloons in. Um, I heat these up. Um, they're filled with water and they, obviously they get hot like little hot water bottles. Now I just wrap them up in the um, in the flannel here. That helps to keep him warm because he should be, um, you know, cuddled up with his family. But obviously, that's not the case now. So I'm having to look after him. So there he is. Um, we can put him in now with some some ripped up shreds of tissue, some bedding. So there he is in there. Um, as I said, very very soft. Um, at the moment, I've got him eating, or trying to get him to eat, um, it's a mixture of cat milk, um, diluted with water, and there's a bit of honey in there too, to make it sweet, so I'm trying to get him to eat that, obviously this is my first time looking after a mouse, so, um, people say there's loads of different things you can give him, I hopefully this should be okay, um, there he is again, really cute, um, and I pretty much now have to be his mother, so, that involves me feeding him, washing him, um, I mean, they're so re reliant on their mothers that I pretty much have to make him poo, which is very nice. Um, I use this cotton wool bud, and you just got to pretty much stroke their stomach to make sure they're digesting their food. So, um, that's him. He normally just snuggles up in here, but um, I'll try and feed him for you now. But I doubt he'll take it. He doesn't really take the milk too well. Because he should be feeding from his mum, but he's having to feed from this pet here. Come on. Nah, I, sh I can't really do it for camera because I should be holding him, but that's what I'm feeding him on. So there he is. Pretty cute. <laughs> he's, um, he's really, it sounds stupid, but he's really kind of sort of bonding with me. See him there, trying to snuffle into my hand. He thinks I'm his, his parent, I guess, so he always likes it when I, when I have him in my hands, but i got to leave him now to go to sleep. So that's him in there. And, um, if you guys enjoy this, Obviously, um, this isn't my regular thing to my subscribers, but if you do, guys do enjoy this, then, um, then put it in the comments and I might make it a regular, more regular thing, um, with updates on them and stuff. So, that's him. Haven't named him yet, but, um, yeah. So, tell me your thoughts, um, and if anyone who's watching this who knows a lot about baby mice or keeping mice, um, I'd greatly appreciate any help.